Right now, breaking news on News Channel 8. That breaking news this morning, I-75 shut down in southern Hillsborough County. A deadly crash and a fire on a car carrier. That's what's causing the slowdown. So we're going to get straight to Beth Rousseau, who's, who's live on the scene for us. Good morning, Beth. Hey, Dan and Chris. So they've been able to actually get that car carrier out of the way from the scene that we're at here on I-75 southbound. Take a look. You can see they've made really quick work of cleaning this up. There's just one wrecker that's left here waiting to tow a couple of these cars away from this scene. Now, if we go ahead, though, and pull up a live look at both of these crashes, you can see there's another incident not far from where we are. This is just miles apart. That's a deadly crash that is also shutting down the southbound lanes of I-75. Now, we were working with Florida Highway Patrol this morning to figure out what happened in both of these cases. I want to go ahead and pull up some video also so that you can see the flames from the car fire that happened earlier this morning. You can see them just billowing from the vehicle. Again, two very serious incidents, and that is the reason why the southbound lanes of I-75 are shut down. Traffic being diverted at Big Bend Road as crews work to not only investigate this fatal crash, but to get both of these scenarios cleaned up. Now, because one of these is a deadly crash, investigators could be out here for quite a while and they could be trying to piece together what exactly happened for most of the morning. Now, back out here live, you can see where we are. They're getting ready to clear these records off the scene. We're going to be in touch with Florida Highway Patrol throughout the morning. In the meantime, though, we know this could have a major impact on your morning commute. So, Brianna Villegas has your workarounds. Good morning, Brianna. Hi, good morning, Beth. So this is going to impact a lot of people that go southbound on I-75 this morning. So this, this is just one of the crashes. It's south of Big Bend Road, and Big Bend Road is actually where traffic's being diverted onto. You could also get off on Gibsonton Drive instead. And once you get off of those exits, go ahead and take US 301, or you can take US 41. And if you want to get back onto the interstate, once you get to that intersection of I-275 and I-75, you can use that exit to keep going southbound on that interstate. As far as the rest of our Bay Area, that's really the only place we're seeing those backups on I-75. So I would definitely take that exit off of Big Bend Road. I'll send it on over to you.